Where are Formula 1 cars built? Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am going to talk about where are Formula 1 cars built. Most Formula 1 cars are built in England, where most teams are based. Others are made through groups in the United States, Italy, and Switzerland. The engines, however, are sourced from Ferrari, Mercedes, Renault, and Red Bull. F1 groups purchase non-listed components from suppliers when possible. While F1 groups are accountable for fielding their cars, most constructors, or racing teams, still need to construct each section for their vehicles. They plan and manufacture fundamental structures, like the front effect structures, survival cells, and bodywork. Keep analyzing to research the place this procedure occurs. Who builds Formula 1 cars? Formula 1 cars are constructed at every Formula 1 team's headquarters using a crew of exceedingly knowledgeable mechanics and engineers. They take a year or extra to develop the use of current and new technologies, alongside driver entry and careful adherence to the guidelines. F1 cars have heaps of character parts. However, only the listed components in the technical guidelines must be designed and constructed using the racing team, regarded in F1 as the constructor. Other components can be made through many groups in opposition or with the aid of third-party manufacturers. All AQs, or engine control units, are made with the assistance of McLaren Technologies, not the F1 team, and all tires are made using Pirelli, particularly for Formula 1. Gearboxes, pressure trains, and brakes are generally transferable from one vehicle to another, even throughout constructors. What is a constructor in Formula 1? Constructors in F1 are responsible for building the listed components per the F1 carrying regulations. As of 2018, the front impacts the structure, bodywork, survival cell, and roll structures. They can produce their engines or buy one from an external source. Only four groups in F1 construct their very own engines, making the final six groups so-called client teams. Non-registered components can be bought from any third-party provider as long as they have been authorized through the FIA. The period constructor refers to any person, team, manufacturer, or entity accountable for growing and setting up a car according to Formula 1 guidelines for Formula 1 racing. When listing the constructor, say for the constructor's championship, the developer of the chassis and engine is typically listed as one entity, even if they have been designed via separate parties. In the case of entities such as McLaren Mercedes, Haas Ferrari and AlphaTauri RBPT, factors are awarded to the groups of McLaren, Haas and AlphaTauri with the engine dealer now not receiving any elements from groups different from themselves. Whichever crew has the most factors at the give-up of the season, based totally on the combined totals of their two drivers, wins the constructors' championship. Who builds Formula 1 engines? There are four engine producers in Formula 1, Mercedes, Ferrari, Red Bull, and Renault. All Formula 1 cars, because 2014, have been powered via a 1.6-liter V6 turbocharged hybrid engine with a max reverend restriction of 15,000 rpm, producing the most horsepower of about 1,000 horsepower at around 10,500 rpm. These engines use an MGUK and an MGUH to complement the inside combustion engine with extra strength, about 160 greater HP, by using two electric-powered motors. The complicated nature of these hybrid engines requires superior machining and manufacturing processes. For this reason, the engine suppliers have committed to F1 engine factories on top of their most important ones. Different engine factories. For example, Mercedes is based totally in Brackley in the UK. However, they have their engine manufacturing facility in Brixworth, about 27 miles away. Alpine's F1 engines are made at the Renault manufacturing unit in very shot alone in France, whilst the chassis aspect of the group is primarily based in Enstone in the UK. Red Bull's engines are presently made in the Honda manufacturing facility in Japan. However, they are setting up a facility for their Red Bull powertrains, RBPT, division due to open in the coming years. Ferrari is an exception to this usual rule, as they make their chassis and engines in the identical place, their manufacturing facility in Marinello. With a financial cap of $140 million in 2022 and a discount to $135 million in 2023, a Formula 1 car's value is less than it used to be in the past. Relative to the total budget, the proper value of a race-ready F1 vehicle is only about 7-11% to of the cap, or $10 to $15 million. What parts can an F1 team buy? Formula 1 teams can purchase or develop any factor that isn't a listed team component, LTC, in the technical regulations. 
These suggestions mandate that a constructor has to improve and personalize the rights to the survival cell. The front affects the structure, role structure, and bodywork, among different things, and that they can't share these components with every other team or constructor. How long does it take to build an F1 car? F1 groups commonly start car improvement for their next car whilst their present-day automobile is racing. How early improvement begins relies upon the following year's regulations. For 2022, groups had to start more now than usual, as the rule changes altered how the automobiles appeared and behaved. However, when not lots changes yearly, development can begin later in the season. But modern-day Formula One, with in-season improvement races excellent deal and ongoing battle, requires groups to be nearly continuously creating their cars. But in terms of creating a vehicle from beginning to finish, it may take somewhere from 12 to 18 months or more. Formula One cars are designed, developed, tested, and assembled at every team's headquarters in their respective countries. Most F1 teams function out of England, with only four groups based in another world. The purpose-built race cars, with rate tags topping $12 million, have turned out to be stapled worldwide car racing over the previous 72 years. Hope you guys like this video. Let us know in the comment below. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. See you in the next video.